Hello everyone, my name is Anton and I'm here with another tip. I'm on the Onyx Books Nova 2 e-ink device. This is their 7.8 device here and I'm in the notes. So today I want to go over templates and maybe show you know, how you can get your custom template into the device and a couple other things about templates when you're on the device. So right here I'm on a blank note with um, basically a blank page. So and this is considered one of their templates. If we click into the templates little icon there, you can see blank, right? I'm on the blank template. I'm into the built-in area here. And there's a lot of different templates that comes with this device that you can search through. You can see we have two pages. So if I go to page two, you can get all the other templates here. There's also an area where you have local and you see there's none here right now. I'll show you how to actually get local templates here. And then there's the cloud. You can download additional templates from the Onyx books um, templates that they have in the cloud. You can go through these here. Um, right now there's a limited and see it's just this one page right here. So there's not too many in the cloud here that are, that are really different from what you have on the local device. But if you don't find a template that you that you think you need to have on this device, what you can do here is you can add one to your local templates. Let me show you how to do that. First, let's go grab a template. The, the nice thing with the Onyx books here is that it's running Android 9 and you're allowed access to certain applications. Um, a browser is on the device by default. So what you can do is you can open up the browser. And what we're going to do here is I'm going to download a template from Canva. So if you go to canva.com, they have a lot of different templates for different use cases. Um, again, there's a lot of stuff in there. I use them for presentations, for uh, word templates, presentation templates, etc. In this case, what we'll do here is in this browser, you can search for checklist. You can see I already had it selected there, but you can search for any template that you, you know, you see, see fit for your purpose that you might want to look for. And the good thing again with this Onyx books is that you can do this on the device. Now the experience in using the browser is not as great as on your computer. So I'll show you later how you can do this on your computer as well. Okay. So we have a, you know, a checklist template here that from canva.com. What we can do here is we can download this template. Let's say this is the one that you want. Go ahead and download. It's going to download as a PDF. Click download. It's going through its process of downloading that file. And we go into the storage area for storage. Storage. And let's look for downloads. Yeah. And this is the file that we just downloaded today. Go ahead and open it. And here you can see this is the checklist that we just downloaded from canva.com. Now, what we want to do is get this, to, this template. Let's go back into storage. And we, if we press and hold, we get a few options here. You can either uh, cut it or copy it. In this case, I'm going to copy this file. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy it into the note template folder under storage. So here, the paste is here on the left. Paste it. So now that has copied this PDF um, of that checklist into the storage slash note template folder. Now let's go back into notes. 
So if we go back into notes, let's go ahead and click on the note that we want to have here and click on the templates. We go into local templates now. You can see that the checklist template is there. We select this template. You can see it's going to use this here and overwrite the current one. Click OK. And now this template is available to us. So we go in here and I can write on this. So for that, here, I can add a page. And you can see the template goes to the next page. One tip on templates when you're in the Onyx books. So when you add a page, the each subsequent page will take the property of the previous template. So what you want to do here, if you want to change this template, because you can, not every page has to have the same template when you're in notes. So what we do here is we go ahead and select the new template again. Let's do the lines this time. And now we have the lines template. Go back to page one, still the checklist. Back to page two. We have the lines. And if we add an additional page, three of three, you can see it took on the lines template, carried that over. But again, this can change to, let's use the big grid. And now we have big grid, lines, and our and our custom checklist. Okay, so now let's show how to get the templates onto your device from the desktop. First, go to your browser or to wherever you may already have um, templates in PDF format that you want to copy over to your device. Here I'm using Canva again just like I did on the device. We can go in here and again, we can just, just look up templates, say, and any of the, any template will do. So it doesn't really matter. Whatever, whatever kind of template you want to use. Um, let's actually, I did checklist before, correct? So let's go back to checklist. We'll go ahead and download one of the checklists. Download PDF print and um, choose one right now. You can see I just chose one that was that's not free. You can you can pay for them, but they're, most of them are free. So just download the PDF to your device that you like to use. Let me see. Here's one. All right. So this one here is free. We'll download that. Then what we need to do is just plug in our device. Okay, so now that the device is plugged in, you can see it comes up here. This here is using the, the Android file transfer I'm on the Mac. And what you really need to do here is just go to the note template folder on this device and copy the PDF that you just downloaded. This checklist here onto the device. So it's that simple. Once you go into your device, and you go into the, the template for your notes, you'll see the new um, template there, and then you can use it. Pretty simple. Okay, that's it for today. I hope this these couple tips help you out in using your device. My name is Anton. If this video helped you in any way, please like it and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you again.